Hi, welcome to day 14. Today we are reading Luke chapter 1, verses 46 through 56. And Mary said, My soul glorifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has been mindful of the humble state of his servant. From now on, all generations will call me blessed, for the Mighty One has done great things for me. Holy is his name. His mercy extends to those who fear him. From generation to generation, he has performed mighty deeds with his arm. He has scattered those who are proud in their inmost thoughts. He has brought down rulers from their thrones, but has lifted up the humble. He has filled the hungry with good things, but has sent the rich away empty. He has helped his servant Israel, remembering to be merciful to Abraham and his descendants forever, just as he promised our ancestors. Mary stayed with Elizabeth for about three months and then returned home. Elizabeth is so happy, she goes right into a song about what God is doing through Mary. Apparently, Elizabeth has some inside knowledge of what God is doing and sees big things like justice and equality happening in the future. For today's prayer, pray that you can be part of God's plan for justice and equality in our world in small ways. Pray for strength to speak up for what is right in your family, work, or school. Pray that God gives you the kind of vision for what the Messiah is going to bring about in the world. Take a moment to pray. For today's practice, at some point today, it is likely that someone will need your support and possibly even ask you to stick up for them. Make sure you take that step of sticking up for someone today. With all our practices, they are invitation-based, meaning it's up to you to decide what you choose to implement, how much, or when. Thanks for following along with us as we prepare our hearts for Christmas. Join us tomorrow, and may God bless you until we meet again.